Hi, welcome back to more coverage from CES 2012. I'm here with Jared from Corsair, and I've got an SSD, or it may not quite be an SSD. I'll let Jared explain. Absolutely. So it, it is an SSD, but it's a different approach. So what we're trying to do uh, with our new accelerator series is actually provide a way for people to get uh, a lot of that SSD performance for a really good value uh, and to make it really easy. So how does this work? Basically plug this in and you've got your regular hard drive and this manages or your oper operating system manages the interaction between the two. But because it's got an SSD inside it, it's a quicker overall experience. Right, absolutely. So yeah, like you said, you plug this in, you run a, you run a software build to make it really, really easy. Uh, and more or less at that point, you don't worry about it. The software takes care of which parts of Windows need to go into the drive, takes care of which applications you're using the most, and it's going to really optimize what you do around what you do instead. So it's, uh, it's going to take care of all of those. So in terms of a buffer, what sizes will this be available in? So this is going to be available in 30, 45, and 60 gig drives. Right. Uh, really, depending on how much you do, uh, you pick what you what you need. 30 gigs, 45 gigs is enough for most usage. So. Right. And um, assuming you get one of these, why wouldn't it make more sense to buy an SSD, say a 60 gig, which is probably the same price, and use a secondary hard drive? So what I would say on that is is that really, uh, if you want to get a 60 gig drive, and if if you're managing your files. Absolutely, get a 60 gig drive. They're they're great. We make a Force 3, we make a Force GT, and um, highly recommend those. What Accelerator gives you instead is a way that you don't have to take care of what's going on to the drive. You don't have to to worry about whether Windows and the three games you're playing and, and Office are all going to fit onto the drive, because the software is going to manage which bits you actually need on there to get the performance. So it's literally a fit and forget affair. Absolutely. Right. And what are the prices on those 30, 45, and 60 gigs? So uh, we're anticipating street prices of uh, $70 for the 30 gig, uh, 85 for the 45, and 99 for the 60 gig. And what about availability? Availability will be mid to end of February. Right. Okay, Jared, thanks very much. Thank you. Do head back for more coverage from CES 2012 with Hexus.